Happy Hunger Games, and may the odds be ever in your favor. Primrose Everdeen. We were all very moved when you volunteered for her through reaping. Just trying to win, but you can't. Listen to me. You're stronger than they are. Get to a bow. They may not have. Well, if you show them how good you are, they just want a good show. That's all they want. People are starving in 12. Here they're just throwing it out to stuff more in. It is a contract. Each district supplies the capital. Like blood to a heart. In return, the capital provides order and security. Nothing can survive without a heart. Three, two, one. What happens in there? Fueled with the terror of becoming prey. See how quickly we become predator? See how quickly civilization disappears? As long as it ends with her picture in the sky and the sign of Canada. They have to have their victim. No. They don't. Remember who the real enemy is. Together? Together. Stop! Stop! Cut them off. Ladies and gentlemen, may I present the winners of the 74th Annual Hunger Games. Why do you think we have a winner? Since the last games, something's different. I can see it. Hope. It is the only thing stronger than fear. A little hope is effective. A lot of hope is dangerous. I have a problem, Miss Everdeen. There were people fighting in the streets. A problem that began the moment you revealed those poison barriers in the arena. Fires and peacekeepers were cutting them down, but the people, they were fighting back. If a girl from District 12 of all places can defy the capital and walk away unharmed, what is to prevent them from doing the same? What is to prevent, say, an uprising? It must be a fragile system if it can be brought down by just a few berries. Not in the way you imagine it. How should I imagine? You should imagine thousands upon thousands of your people dead. This town of yours reduced to ashes. Imagine it gone. I should have just eaten berries in the arena and died like I was supposed to. Then everything would be back to normal and everyone would be safe. Safe for what? To starve? Work like slaves? Send their kids to the reaping? You haven't heard people, Katniss. You've given them an opportunity. They just have to be brave enough to take it. We need to unite these people out there that have been doing nothing but killing each other in an arena for years. We have to have a light and rod. They'll follow her. She's the face of the revolution. She can't handle it. The games destroy her. For one second that the capital will ever treat us fairly, you are lying to yourself. Isn't that what I promised you? Our mocking Jay. Because we know who they are and what they do. This is what they do, and we must fight back. We all have one enemy. He corrupts everyone and everything. He turns the best of us against each other. Stop. Killing for him! Turn your weapons to the capital. Turn your weapons to snow. You can torture us and bomb us and burn our district to the ground. The fire is catching. And if we burn, you burn with us. Run! Oh.
Wake up. This trip doesn't end when you get back home. It's very simple. The story of the Queen you know is true. My name is Candace Everdeen. My home is District 12. I was in the Hunger Games. I escaped. Beat up. You never get off this train. But our lives were never ours. PETA is the capital's weapon, the same way you're ours. Our lives belong to Snow and our deaths do too. Dead or alive, Katniss Everdeen will remain the face of this revolution. I had no idea I meant so much to her. Let's bring up the setting. Little one. There was no real life because we didn't have any choice. I just want them to change me, turn me into something I'm not. It's better not to give in to it. You mean you won't kill anyone? No one who supports the capital is innocent. With that kind of thinking, you can kill whoever you want. The proposal is this. You can send kids off to the Hunger Games to keep the districts in line. We hold a symbolic Hunger Games. I just keep wishing that I could think of a way to show them that they don't own me. This is the revolution. Our tributes from District 12. And you are the Mockingjay. I just don't want to be another piece in their game. I want to still be me. Not the mocking Jay. Just Katniss. If I see you again, it's gonna be a different world. Today, the greatest friend to the revolution. There she is, Captain Seventeen! We'll fire the shots to end all wars. Let it be for a cause, not a spectacle. Let it be for all of Pen Am, and let it be forever. Don't make no mistake. She intends to take my place now. I never asked for this. I never asked to be in the games. To be the Mockingjay. I just wanted to save my sister and keep Peta alive. It's the things we love most that destroy us. Bram is gone! Bram is gone! He just goes around and around and he wins. I am done being a piece in his game. If you end all of this, all those deaths, they mean something. I love you. I love you too.